So you might be trying to figure out how you can play NES games on your Nintendo Switch, Nintendo Switch OLED, or Nintendo Switch Lite. Now doing this is very easy because there is an official way of doing this licensed by Nintendo, which is awesome. So you will, spoiler alert, you will have to have the Nintendo Switch Online Expansion Pack in order to do this. So it is a you know, monthly subscription thing that a majority of you probably already are signed up for. If not, I have Nintendo Switch Online, I don't have the Expansion Pass because I don't play NES games on my Switch Lite. But essentially what you can do here, if you want to try this out, you can make your way over to your Nintendo Switch Online button that is at the very bottom right here. So all you have to do is go and click at the very bottom right here and go and tap on the display right here. And what you want to do is you want to go and tap into whatever user that you're using. And at that point, what you want to do is you'll come into the Nintendo Switch Online portion of their specific you know, website. Now, as long as you're connected to Wi-Fi, you should be able to come here. So now what you want to do is you want to go and scroll down and you want to go ahead and open up this specific page. Now, when you're here, what you want to do is you want to swipe to the right and you want to go ahead and basically find the NES button, which is right here. You can also tap into it and it should take you into right into the exact where you want to do. But if you go and click B for a second, you should be able to see all the NES games that are available now. As you can see, you can tailor it down. So here you can go and click NES and it'll go and show you all the NES games that are available that you can actually play on your Nintendo Switch Lite. And there are a lot of them. So now when you're ready, what you want to do is you want to go and click on the NES button right here. And you can go ahead and use this as a free download. And you can go ahead and download it completely for free onto your device, which is so awesome. So now it'll tell you a system is required. Okay, whatever. It's going to make me you know, update my device. But at this point, it'll take you straight into the eShop. And all you're going to have to do here is go ahead and download that specific file. And it should go ahead and once it's downloaded, show up on your main page. And you can go and open it up and use it from there. Like I said, I don't have the expansion pack, so it's not really going to be visible for me. But that's pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.